And Nixa tonight, the planning begins. Good evening once again to you. I'm glad you're here for our broadcast. I'm David Oliver and Heather is off this evening. Nixa voters passed two questions on the ballot last night that included a school bond issue at a 41 cent tax levy. Both of these will go toward funding new projects in the district. Color 10's Madison Heaver tells us tonight what the district is focusing on next. Voters in Nixa were very excited last night when they learned the two questions on the ballot for Nixa schools had passed. It was very exciting just uh, you know, being with your team and your board and watching the ballots uh, votes come in and uh, seeing the positive results for both ballot initiatives that we had. Uh, Nixa school superintendent Dr. Gerald Loden says he's happy with the outcome, but now they're focused on the future. Now, you know, the next steps come. We're, uh, We'll be very busy this summer working with our architects and our board and stakeholders on this fine tuning our plans and making sure we have the detailed plan. So what's next? The two questions cover renovations for lots of things like adding classrooms at Century Elementary and building repairs. We maintain our buildings every year like you would a home, but after about 20 years it's time for new air conditioning roofing. But they're also adding some new things like a new sports complex and a new performing arts center at Nixa High School. Nixon School is known not just throughout the state but outside the state. It will continue to be a leader and innovative and uh, our teachers and while we're, where we're at it's not so much the buildings as the teachers in the classrooms every day they're working with their children. And for people who are on the fence about moving to Nixon now that there's a tax increase? Well we're still the best buy. Uh, when you look historically we're spending about two thousand dollars less than the state average. So we're still going to be a best buy where uh, you have a district that uses its dollars very wisely in a frugal manner to, to give results. Madison Heaver, Ozarks First. By the way, that tax levy passing means people are going to be paying about 41 cents per $100 of property value that you own. This will increase teacher salaries as well.